am announcing a number of changes to the national executive, the cabinet. Now, these changes are occasioned by the untimely passing of Minister Edna Mulewa, as well as the resignation of Minister Malusi Kigaba. And in making these changes, I remain determined that the cabinet of our nation should have uh, what I would call an appropriate mix of experience and capability, as well as gender, as well as a generational mix as well. And that it should have members who are committed to serve the people of our country, are mindful of the need to have a resolute and stable cabinet that is able to effectively lead the growth effort that we have embarked upon, the renewal effort as well as the transformation effort. I've decided to make the following appointments. Minister of Home Affairs will now be Dr. Siabonga Kwele. Minister of Environmental Affairs will now be Ms. Nombula Mukonyani. And Minister of Communications will be Ms. Stella Ndabeni Abrahams. Now, I've also decided to merge the Ministries of Communications and Telecommunications and Postal Services into a single ministry under the new Minister of Telecommunications and Communications, Minister Stella Ndabeni Abrahams. This move is going to ensure that we have better alignment and coordination of matters that are critical to the future of our economy, particularly in the context of the fourth industrial revolution. Now, the two departments will report to the new ministry, namely the Department of Communications, as well as the Department of Telecommunications and Postal Services. They will remain separate departments until the fifth administration. Now, the decision to merge the two ministries is in line with the work that we have been undertaking in line with the announcement that I made during the State of the Nation address that we are going to look at realigning uh, government. Uh, and in anticipation of the sixth democratic administration, we will have completed this work. And when we have completed it and after the elections, we will then be able to have a much more comprehensive announcement on how we will have realigned government. But it is also to help with the realigning process, which we need right now in order to put into effect the transformation that we are effecting uh, with regard to the economic management.